G'day folks, it's John from Thailand again. I've been down at what we call Granny Block, which is only a half fly size block, uh, which is this one here. And I've been working on the electricals up under the, the shade house. We've only had the, you know, it'll be a week tomorrow when the guys came and put the shade cloth on for me. Um, <laughs> it was originally going to be a greenhouse and I did plan to grow tomatoes probably up to two and a half metres. So it's three metres inside plus the, the curvature at this end, which is about 600, 3.6 high. And I don't have a ladder that high. And I looked at buying one and they're like about 6,000 baht. Um, my dickhead brother-in-law has been, uh, did grow cucumbers here. He's left it in a bit of a mess. Well, from my point of view, we need it level because we're going to put two more fish tanks here after we put the three in here. I got it, I got it pegged out for four tanks, well actually three tanks plus one where the where the concrete uh, stumps are, which will be the support for the tanks. I was gonna put one, two, three, four, and they were gonna be four and a half by two. But now I'm thinking what we'll do is we'll put one five and a half meters across here, five and a half meters in this area, and probably two meters wide maybe 2.4 i'm not sure i got to think about it a bit more and two six meters long up there so that'll work out not what i originally planned but this shade cloth is definitely a bonus here definitely a bonus i've been working on the electricals this morning and i'm only feeling as hot as i normally would see like uh up there's double PowerPoint, one for the security camera, one for anything else we might need. We've got another light here, which is going to be wired in. Oh, everything's going to be wired in. Uh, that's got, uh, wait a minute, that one's got a PowerPoint as well. That one's just a light, and that one's just a light, I think. No, I can see inside the box. <laughs> it's a PowerPoint as well, and then a PowerPoint here. Uh, the power coming from the, the pump shed will be connected up there with all the other wires. I've got to test it first before I do any mains connection. I've got uh, some switches in today. This one's like a weatherproof, even though it's weatherproof, I'll still put silicone around there and around there and around there. Uh, that, uh, I put silicone around. The top there where it's got a bit of a gap but i won't worry about the rest that's a power point in there there's one one exactly the same over there if we need air pumps it gives us a you know power that's down on ground level those power points are okay up there if we have um you know like a light or something coming across like, uh, might be some reason, so I thought I'd better put them in now than stuff around later on because we need, like, uh, one cable for light and one cable for power. And, uh, you yeah, know, best to put it in now. So that's all done. Well, not quite. <laughs> it's nearly done. Let's say nearly. Nearly is a good word. Um, yeah, probably tomorrow or the next day I'll... I'll have everything wired up and we can do a test with 12 volt. I've got a couple of, I've got a couple of batteries there, motorbike batteries I use to power the sludge pump to pump water into the, the water tower out at the dam at Namong. So that'll do as our test power. Anyway, I'm off. Some character playing music there. I guess he's selling something. And uh, yeah, morning tea time for me. We're right on the road here, which is good. Eventually, we'll build a fence so that people can't come in and help themselves to the fish, or as they call them in Thailand, blah. Okay, folks, have a good day. Bye now.